Not another damn shadow. Right, enough is enough! Let's start the incantation. You want to help me? That's good. I have no idea how many servants work for a master of the shadows. Once I've started the incantation, there's no turning back. The spell will continue to work until the entire hierarchy has been exterminated. Are you sure we should start it now? Let's begin. All right. Prepare yourself. Razla, Vertigo, Hierarchar, Varlava, Krafra. Good to see you too. There's no end to these foul creatures. There's no end to these foul creatures.
Oh, my head. You all right? Have we done it? It looks that way. That was extremely enlightening. That seems to be the normal size of a shadow hierarchy. You face them all in battle. For now, the knowledge gained should be sufficient. Thank you for your help. Here's a token of my gratitude. I'm going to ponder this for a while. Perhaps I can improve the spell to omit the minor servants. But I will probably never try something like that again. At best, I'll do it in the mage's camp, under controlled conditions. Didn't I tell you to stay away from the graves? Yes, but I didn't realize you meant this grave. I'll count to three. One. Up. Uh, two. Okay, okay, I'm gone already. I'll be in the tavern. Just leave me alone. I'm pressed. Thank you for your help. I'll take a break in the tavern before I go and make my report.
I found the grimoire. Excellent. Show it to me. Here. Wonderful. Was it in the old castle ruins to the west? Yeah. With a pretty bad-tempered shadow lord. Yes. I knew he was hiding there. I'm glad that you were able to rescue this. What happened to the Shadow Lord? The Shadow Lord in the West is no more. Ah, that should lift the spirits a bit. Well done. What will you do with the Grimoire? I have to study it. I have to learn how to lure your spirit back into your body. Meanwhile, you should hone your skills. Join a strong faction and learn their combat skills. You will need all your power to survive. About your warriors. Cyril buried the dead in the north. Good. I'm glad that at least he came back. Fen could no longer save one of the farms. These are hard times indeed when defenseless farmers pay the price for our war. Mason completed his guard duty in the north. That's good. Mason is one of our best men. Porter had a few problems with ghosts in a graveyard. The most important thing is that he's with us in one piece. Wilson the blacksmith has lost his apprentice Alvito. Yes, I heard. Terrible. But we have to look to the future. The enemy does not share our grief. Winter has overcome his cowardice. He's back to normal. Very good. I thought we'd lost him. Your remaining warriors have returned. There's far too few of them. But we must still take on our next task. You have been a great help to us. Thanks. Without you, our situation would have been even more hopeless. I want to be a demon hunter. Let the ceremony begin. All right, but you must be certain. Once you have become a demon hunter, you will not be able to join another faction. Search your soul once more, and then come to a decision. I'm certain. I will become a demon hunter. Let the ceremony begin. Good. The time has come. I will summon everyone. We are gathered here today to celebrate our meeting in the safe haven of the Citadel. Many have left us. Their fate lay beyond the battlefield. However, their deaths will not be in vain. You are the Dark Warriors of Calador. You were born to give your lives for the ancient covenant. If blood is spilt, it shall be avenged. If walls are shattered, they shall be rebuilt. Because we have newcomers in our midst who have brought us hope. Look at them. Proud men, full of strength and drive. So I ask you, are you ready to take up arms against the shadows? We are ready. We're ready. So be it. Scouts of the ancient covenant of Calador. You are the last bulwark between humanity and the darkness. Now, prepare yourselves for battle. May the fires of Calador burn through the shadows, dark warriors of Calador. And you, you need a big ship. Go and see Kane, the warrior on the frigate in the Iron Bay, 
and convince him to join us in battle. You're a demon hunter now. Maybe he listen to you. Nice speech. Passionate. For a druid. We live in difficult times, my lad. We must fight together, or we are finished. I've joined a faction. And you chose. And I say, I'm delighted you chose to join us. I don't think you'll regret it. What do we do now? We can now discuss your spirit. How will the Grimoire help us? There's an entry on a spirit ritual. It summons a spirit from the underworld and binds it to the body of the living dead. The madman gave a zombie reason. Hmm, strange. But that's what it says here. I don't believe it. Just imagine you wake up one morning and are stuck in your own rotting carcass. Wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. If the ritual worked before, it'll definitely work for you. What if the other part of my mind comes back from the underworld? Oh, fuck. I think I've got to let the implications sink in first. Good. We'll talk later. Take your time, lad. A ritual. Yeah, that's probably my last hope.
Get on with it. Wise decision, my boy. The ancient writings of Kalador have not disappointed me yet. What do we need for your ritual? The Grimoire mentions a powerful magic spell that can call your spirit and bind it to your body. Unfortunately, the spell itself isn't detailed in there, but it does say where we can find it. The entire ritual must take place in a location that is magically shielded from the outside world. We also need three sorcerers who are powerful enough to cast such a spell. You are a powerful sorcerer. Yes. I can help you with your ritual. However, my work here in Kalador is not yet complete. The shadows still threaten us from the other side of the lava. We must attack and drive the evil from the island. About the spirit ritual. Do you know where to find the spell for the spirit ritual? One of the Dark Warriors studied this magic. We might find the records in his dwelling. All right. And where is that exactly? He lived beyond the eastern side of the stream of lava. That's where you'll find the ruins. I understand. The mages are powerful sorcerers. That's true. But lately, they have been occupied with researching crystal magic. That has weakened them. I fear that only the most powerful will be strong enough to help us with the spirit ritual. And who might that be? Without a doubt, Zacharias is the most powerful mage. Ask him for help. What about one of the native shamans? That's a good idea. The voodoo priests are experts in the spirit world. The most powerful voodoo witch I know is Chani. She is the daughter of a chieftain of the natives. Go and find her. We need her powers. You mentioned a place that was shielded by magic. Yes, and that is indeed a problem. Legends exist of ancient beings who were able to create a sphere of magical tranquility. But that knowledge has now been lost. Even the oldest of the dark warriors of Kalador know nothing of it. We're gonna chase after some legend? I'm sorry. It's the best I can come up with at the moment. So I'm supposed to find an ancient being? Yes. And it must still be alive today in order to help us. And it's supposed to be old? Very old. Even older than the Titan Lords. It must have seen the rise and fall of the first civilizations in this world. It's old enough to have seen the very first days. Back when our world began. All right, I get it. Good. How are you going to cross the lava? There is a teleporter on the other side, but it is inactive. I could build a bridge by setting up a magical web. How would you do that? If all teleporter platforms on this side of the lava were activated, I could combine their energy. That combined force could be used to catapult one or more people across the lava. Have you ever done that before? No, but it'll work. All the other teleporters need to be activated first before I try it. Everything else is just theory. About the spirit ritual. Where can I find such an ancient being? Head to the islands and the southern seas. Can't you be a bit more precise? Uh, maybe search the old temples built by the natives. They're the oldest buildings in the region. 
If such a creature truly does still exist, you should be able to find a trace even now. What can you teach me? What would you like to know? I'll make Connor pay. Who's gonna take over the farm? Nature. Nature? After what happened, no one will want to move in. So the house will begin to decay, and eventually it will just become another ruin. Welcome to Calador. I can feel the cowardice melting away. Show me how to cast a Demon Blade spell. The spell will certainly be useful. Teach me a reinforcement spell. The spell will certainly be useful. Show me how to cast a Thunderbolt spell. The spell will certainly be useful. What do you sell? Careful with your weapon or someone will get hurt.
got a spell for me. I've been working on a special spell for a while now. Actually, I could use your help with it. It's not that easy and you only have one try. If you're unsuccessful, the spell will remain out of your reach. What do you want me to do for you? I performed a conjuration last night in the Iron Woods. I summoned six horrifying ghosts. However, I wanted to prepare myself before I go bust these ghosts. Why do you want to hunt ghosts? That's exactly where my problem lies. I want to use the power that a dying ghost releases to create a magic spell. But there are only six ghosts, and I need the energy from all of them. The conjuration is very fragile. That means they mustn't see you. If just one of them sees you, they'll all disappear. And then we won't have the ability to summon the ghosts again. How can I climb the ranks? Make yourself useful to us. I'll make sure you get credit for everything you do for us. But if you really want to advance quickly, you should go help Wilson. He took on a huge job that he doesn't have the time for. Help him with that, and I'll consider whether you're ready to join the ranks of the Demon Hunters. I'll go and hunt the ghosts for you. I understand, but remember that they mustn't see you under any circumstances. If we intend to use the energy they release upon death, you really have to keep an eye out. It's best if you sneak up on them from behind and stab them. Here, I've got something for you. Use it. With that, you'll be able to see shadows and other lower creatures of the underworld. That should light the ghosts up like the lava canyon, so you won't be ambushed by them. So, you want to risk your butt for our cause? Well, it can't hurt. I hope you'll survive for longer than most of us. But tell me, are you ready to render a great service to our community? The demon hunters can rely on me. Spoken like a true warrior. I'm getting to like you more and more. Watch out! This damn brood somehow managed to circulate their cursed books among the people. We must get hold of these books. Before long, we won't know who's on our side anymore. I'll find those damn books. I hope you do. Doesn't bear thinking what would happen if people believe the bloody nonsense from those bastards. I don't want to find my blades pointed at me one day. Why have you been entrusted with the books? Oh, you think just because I'm the blacksmith, it doesn't concern me? But that's where you're wrong. Our fates concern us all. My word carries weight here. I'm capable of more than just folding steel. Where should I look for those damn books? The Shadows wouldn't just trust their books to any fool. I believe you will find the majority of the books with certain influential people. The best thing is to look around here on Calador. And you will certainly find something in my native town, Antigua. Visiting the mages will also do no harm. Where exactly am I supposed to look for books? All right. What do you need to know? Any idea where I should look on Calador? Well, if anyone knows, it will be Travis, the barkeeper or Yvette the whore in the tavern. I can't think of anyone else. Who among the mages could give me more information? I'm sure at least one of them must be a bookworm. Although... Uh, wait, no, forget it. Ask around in the harbor. There's all kinds of shit being delivered there anyway, so why not a few damn books? Why should I look for a book on Antigua of all places? Because I wouldn't put anything past those stupid boozers. Believe me, there's always at least one who will go in for a crackpot idea. Check me one of those thugs. T. 
Teach me the heroism spell. The new power will help you. Show me how to protect myself with a ruined skin. The new power will help you. I've joined your faction. Good. Very good. It's good to see our ranks are growing again. We always need new blood. Now, aside from the shadows, there are other creatures roaming this patch of ground. Who were you talking about? The most vile rabble you could ever imagine. Looters. Pfft. While we hold the post here, those bastards dig for knowledge of the ancient civilization. Clearly, the green is not only attracting the righteous. Where am I supposed to look for the marauders? I don't know where they're hiding, but I know someone who might. You mean Travis, the tavern keeper? Aye, he knows about everything. I bet that scum had a few drinks at his place to pluck up courage. Yeah, he should be able to help you. I'll deal with the marauders. Good. But don't be squeamish. Better your blade in their chests than a knife in your back. I don't have time to chat. Back to work. I want to learn something. What do you want to know? Show me how to increase my endurance in melee combat. I can't teach you any more of this. You're really good. I want to learn a better striking combination. Well, mix it up a little. Experiment. Each fighter's got their own style. The best combination depends on weight and stature. Get your blade out and have a go. You're almost as good as me now. There's nothing more I can teach you. And if I can't, you're screwed. I'd like to inflict more damage in melee combat. Now, you're one of the best swordsmen in the land. There is nothing more anyone can teach you. Can you teach me something? Possibly. 